Well, hi guys, happy Sunday to you. Thanks for stopping by, Irish guy JG, Jesse's in the house. I'm out in the shop. I know it's a little dark, but hey, here's a message for you. I saw a message from Inez Marinan, I-N-E-Z-M-A-R-R-I-N-A-N. Inez Marinan, she has an incredible channel uh, and she shares an incredible message for Jesus Christ, the gospel, the, everything that she talks about is on point with what we need to be hearing right now. Some of us are feeling so inspired after hearing a message like that. Now on a Sunday, I've listened to already two or three messages, so I'm already kind of flying high and I feel really good. I'm on cloud nine right now with Jesus because I just know that he's here and he's working through each and every one of us, each and every one of us, you guys, me, Inez. Uh, the Manas, Lisa's in the hospital right now. Lisa and Michael, uh, Matthew are, are are in the hospital, and I, I don't have an update for you guys, but all I know is that we did our part. We sent prayers up to the big man to see if we can curb this illness that she has or infection or whatever this happens to be. So, Inez Marinan, go check her channel out. I'll put a link in the description below, but just an incredible message because, you know what, sometimes we forget that we've always had a father. You see, Jesus didn't, he didn't come down here he became man. He was already sinless, perfect, a God, a king. Jesus is king. But he came down to earth to become man, to die for our sins. He led a human life and, 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 and died a human death, a miserable, terrible, unacceptable death that none of us would ever want to go through for anything. But you see, Jesus went through it for all of us. So can you see the contrary there? See, we're, we're man, we're born man, and a lot of other people out there are trying to become gods. We see Jesus came down to save sinners, but he became man. He is already perfect. And once you, once you let that set in, and once that realization kind of sets in, and you, you think about that for a little while, it's some heavy, heavy thinking stuff. But it's also food for thought, because you also get to realize that, hey, he was perfect. He has a solution for us. If we just simply accept the fact that he died for our sins, we go out and spread the message, and we admit, we admit that we're sinners. We admit that, hey, we mess up sometimes. We're not gods. We're human. We're man. But he came down to show us how to lead a life. So that's an incredible message, you guys. I just found that to be incredible. You know, I never really thought about that. I mean, I, you do, but you don't. But Jesus was, he became man. He had to, he had, he stubbed his toe, it hurt. He had a toothache, it probably hurt. Um, although, you know, these are just assumptions. But I mean, I guess when you think about it, Jesus was human. He was a brother, just like anybody else. So he probably had, you know, besides the faults and the character defects and the character flaws that we have, he probably did stub his toe and be like, gosh dang it, or, you know, or, or felt pain and and anguish and and hurt and abandonment and 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 surrender at some point and whatever he whatever he felt on the cross was just overwhelmingly too much to think about for me because i get kind of emotional when i think about that because to think that somebody had to endure it's too much so you guys go over and check out inez's um um, channel, I think you're going to be pleasantly surprised. Go check it out. Pray for Lisa. We need to pray for Lisa because the enemy is hard at work. He comes at us from every angle, top, top, down, east, west, north, south. He is every which way he can get his hands on us. He tries to. So if you constantly pray and you're constantly in prayer to the to the Holy Spirit, asking the Holy Spirit to protect you, asking for hedges of protection, put on that armor of God. Put on that 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 armor of God put it on read the Bible so you know what you're talking about and so you can have some sort of clue of what might be taking place out there because when you're out in the real world and you witness something that might not be right you need to you need to be able to categorize that okay was that of God probably not well then if it wasn't of God then we know what it is so we know what we need to do we need to rebuke it pray ask God what to do on it right so love you guys um, another message coming later. I just want you guys to check out Inez's uh, channel right now. And I also want you guys to remember that we have a father. He's in heaven. He will return. He will return. Praise Jesus. Glory be to God.